Okay guys, what's good? How are you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to Vinyl TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. I will appreciate it. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we got here. This printer is HP LaserJet M110W. This printer is one of the smallest laser jet printer out there. I'm going to give you an overview of this printer. Then for us to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. Before we do that, this printer, I want to mention that what is included in the packaging, power cables, two power cables included. This is two pin power cable. And this, that, this one here is three pin power cable. It's included in the packaging. I want to say uh, at the back here, the USB cable goes right in here. This printer is dual band. You can connect it via USB cable or Wi-Fi network, which you are going to connect as well. So the USB cable goes here, and this section goes to the back of your PC or laptop. It's universal. Epson can use it. Canon can use it. We have this at Vinetech store, free delivery here in UK. I'm going to put up a link how to get this okay and I'm going to turn this printer around this printer is very compact very small but work very efficiently now you can see this plastic make sure you leave this plastic it just to arrange the paper when you are printing it out okay so you from the top here the first button is Switch this printer on and off button. The second one is information button. The third is Wi-Fi button. At the moment, Wi-Fi is flashing because it's not yet connected to Wi-Fi network. And this, you can load various sizes of paper, A4 paper, A5, B5, various sizes. You just need to adjust it with the holder, okay? Just need to adjust it. So load various sizes of paper right here. And open this printer up. This printer is using ink toner. 1412A. If you check my video, how we loaded the toner right now, just need to go straight in. So, this the toner is using 142A. Once you go in, you hear a click sound and just close it. Now, what I want to mention also this printer, you got six months instant ink. Okay, six months instant ink with this printer. You can cancel this the essence of it you will never run out of ink and save up to 50 percent on toner get toner plus hassle free free delivery and recycle all starting at one pound 199 euro i think it's one nine 129 here in uk uh myself like i mentioned i like to use this pay as you go okay but it's up to you this printer, the function, it can only print with this printer. Um, that might be disadvantage for a lot of people, but myself, if you have a lot of experience, you can also connect this printer to your mobile phone and use your phone to scan the document you want to scan and send it to this printer. At the moment, there's no uh, uh, glass scanner, okay? So you can only print with this printer, okay? The idea is for you to print, but you can connect this printer with HP Smart App, then use your phone, to scan the document and send it the job to this printer and it will work okay like like i mentioned earlier connection is wi-fi and usb cable you can print speed is 22 20 print per minute for a4 paper handling up to 150 sheet of paper you can load it on the over here uh, i mean on the paper tray you have two months two years HP warranty with this printer right here. This printer is for all location printing black and white. So it's not colored, okay? Um, so it's not colored lesser. It's just a black and white uh, lesser. Now, what I want us to do is for us to connect this printer. But before we do that, I'm going to bring the camera close for you to see. So bringing the camera close, you can see a blue light is flashing here. The Wi-Fi light is flashing intermittently. It may signify that this printer is not yet connected to Wi-Fi network. Once it's connected, it will be a steady blue light. This is the on and off button. 
this button here is information button it was on when the toner it was not connected so once you connect this printer the lights here will be flashing if the toner is not connected but at the moment we install the toner properly okay so what we're going to do right now is to connect this printer to wi-fi network so i want you to please get your mobile device and follow me with this tutorial now for us to connect this printer to wi-fi network i want you to get the mobile device okay and um, this is my mobile device i'm getting okay so get your android smartphone okay now go to your play store so make sure this printer is on as well and your wi-fi network we are connecting is connected on my mobile phone and also we need to connect the wi-fi with this printer at the same time so go to play store okay and download type hp smart app okay this is hp smart app right now it's on already downloaded on my phone so you just need to download it but at the moment it's asking me asking update so we just need to update it okay So what it's doing right now is updating. You just need to make sure it's up, updated all the time so that you have all the necessary features in the app working for you. As it's updating, I want you also, also to, I'm going to switch off the, my mobile data is what I'm going to do right now just to use the Wi-Fi sometimes it interferes so this is why i want to switch the mobile data off and focus uh do this connection with wi-fi so right now we're just waiting for this app hp smart app to be ready okay i can see it's ready now click it open so download it once you download it click it open right now we is uh, waiting here we go it's opening So once it's open, it's connecting to HP service. So it's getting the necessary information. Okay, right now this is the HP Smart App. So what we need to do is with this Smart App, you can see Instant Ink, Get Supplier, Printable, Shortcut, Mobile Fast, Camera Scan, Help and Support, print photo, print document, printer scanner, and copy. So, but before we do any of that, what we need to do is we need to add this printer, okay? Either you click plus here, okay? Once you click plus, then it will bring out this section for you to choose a type of printer to add. Set up a new printer, okay? Is the option we need to choose if it's already printer that you connected already then you select the one add a printer that is already set up so what we need to do is set up a new printer click on it get started now i will ask you the information how do you want to connect this printer so you have wi-fi network the first one and the tank cable the second one so what we are doing is to connect it via wi-fi wi-fi so connect the printer wirelessly network so it's the most flexible okay so select on it okay once you select on it connect to wi-fi network the first option click continue now it asks is telling us get printer ready so make sure you get the printer ready okay place the printer on the flat surface then plug it on and power on connect your mobile device to network turn on nearby location like you know allow the blue uh, bluetooth on your mobile device okay then when prompted HP Smart App need your permission to do this. So this is the basic information, you know, like ground check for you to know what to do. So click on continue. And once, here we go. Once you click continue, it will start to search the available printer. And right now you can see, we found this printer 
okay so i found the printer H H hp lesserjet m110w so right now we need to connect the wi-fi net detail so and also you pick the office wi-fi network so depending on where you are doing this it will pick your wi-fi network straight away okay so right now what we need to do is to type the password a lot of people tend to ask me where can you get the password you get the password for your wi-fi network for at the back of your router or from your network provider so i have the information right here but a lot of people tend to ask where will you get wi-fi details so you get the wi-fi detail from the back of your router the information is there the send what details you are using for your mobile device is also what you need for your printer so i'm going to type the details right now and we'll go from there So the other thing you can do is just need to make sure you check. Okay, once you put the password, check, double check it to make sure the information you put is correct. If anything is missing, then it will not work. I'm pretty much happy with what information we put here. And the next thing we need to do is click. Okay, click continue. Okay, click continue. Now it's asking us turn bluetooth on bluetooth is required to set up the printer click continue so right now it will turn the bluetooth on okay allow bluetooth click allow so turning bluetooth on okay and the next process is connecting the printer printer is found it will take a green good mark to tell you that the printer is found okay now the next thing the next thing is, is preparing the printer. If the information we put is correct, okay. And right now it's asking us press the flashing Wi-Fi button on your printer for security. We confirm your proximity to the printer. Right now, so you can, you can see there's a Wi-Fi button here flashing. So you just need to press it once, okay. Press it once, here we go. So the next thing now is preparing the printer, assessing the network information. Printer is prepared, okay? Then the next thing is obtaining an IP address. It's obtaining, so you just need to wait for IP address to be obtained. Here we go. Printer, IP address obtained printer connected to wi-fi network you can see so right now this printer is connected okay and if you look over here before we do anything i want to to see i'm going to bring the camera close for you to see if you look to the printer you will see a steady wi-fi steady blue light is on right now okay and also on your mobile device you also tell your printer connected to wi-fi network so right now you can see a steady blue light printer connected to wi-fi network and the next thing you need to do you just need to follow the instruction to set up the ink if you want the ink service you just need to follow the instruction and register a printer and set up the ink service which i'm also going to show you but setting this up so from the phone you just need to go ahead and click continue and once you click continue it will start to connect to HP service and getting the inf information. So basically this is how to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. You just say thank you for waiting. So you just need to uh, be patient. This is one of the smallest printer out there. It's, it's very nice. Right now, it's checking the printer status.
you just need to be patient okay now it's connecting to hp service so click continue now the other thing is asking is select the language select your country okay so if you select your language okay united kingdom so depending on where you reside just need to select the country you reside okay united kingdom click continue okay and language is english go ahead okay here we go this is introducing hp plus okay now thank you for choosing hp okay so it's telling you about the features you have six months okay six months instant ink and an additional year of hp warranty so click continue okay so click continue Right now, it's going to register this printer. It's registering the printer. But if you're happy with it, then you go ahead and make sure you register the printer for you to receive the, okay, welcome to HP. Enjoy HP benefit. So right now, asking load the instant ink trial. You know, so you're loading the instant ink trial. But I want you to see, okay, you can also skip this. Okay, so redeem your six months of HP Inc. So asking us right now to redeem the six months, redeem this offer within seven days. Enroll Instant Inc. Receive your first set of cartridge in a few days, six months. So if you want to do this, then you go ahead. But because this is tutorial, so I'm going to skip it. So it's really up to you to make this, that decision. But so this is the process for you to. A lot of people do ask me, how do you set up the ink? So if you want to reduce this, redeem this you just need to click continue continue okay but because this is tutorial so i'm going to skip the benefit donor benefit okay nice asking asking us are you sure yes skip the offer so right i have skipped the offer but if it's something that you know resonate with you if it's something that you like to have on your printer then you need to go ahead and click continue for you to register okay so the next thing you just need to uh about toner okay and click continue it's, it's what is asking us right now we need to load the paper okay which we're also going to do okay so click continue here we go setup complete so right now the setup for connecting this printer to wi-fi network is completed okay so if we want to print a document we just need to print okay print a document or skip printing page so i'm going to skip printing page now if you want to print from other device then you share the link not right now okay here we go okay so this is the this is this printer right now okay it's asking us you can see the red sign it's just because the paper tray is not loaded which I'm also going to show you how to load the paper tray on my next video. Okay, so once you load the paper tray, then you, can, you are ready to print out the document. If you're happy with this tutorial, please do consider to subscribe. Thank you and stay blessed. Thank you. This is how to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. Thank you.